Hi! As you can see, today I am going to be reviewing a wig from Dreamholic. And as you can guess, it is this wig that I'm wearing. <laughs> this is the Hime Mi Miji. I would guess it's Miji, not Migi. Hime Miji. <laughs> oh gosh, don't quote me on that, okay? Here's the name. And it's in the colour Steel Grey. Now, little, little funny story time. Um, I was stupid and I wanted to get a wig from Dreamholic because they were having a sale. And I've seen how really pretty all the wigs are. So I was like, yay, opportunity, I can buy a pretty wig. Because it was 10% off and free shipping. I was looking around and I preferably wanted one. To cosplay with as well as just wear. Yeah, there was a short one which I was gonna get in black for my May cosplay but then that was sold out. I have a wig now for that anyway so it's all good. So then I went on the longer wigs and this said it came in steel grey and I was stupid and I didn't realise that that was the first picture on the- because it had different pictures of the colours and some pictures had the name and some didn't, so I thought- <laughs> I just presumed that this was like one of the light brown colours because there was loads of different colours that you could get for this style so I was just thought, oh there's not a picture of the grey one and I wanted a grey wig, a long grey wig for quite a few cosplays so yeah, I got that and then when this arrived I felt really stupid because yeah, like I said, it was the first picture and I didn't realise. Anyway, I really like it. <laughs> it's really funny because kind of I don't know how to explain it. Basically, this colour is very similar to what my natural colour was. I don't know if any of you relate when some people that are born blonde they get to at some point in their life and it goes brown. And it's a really, really weird brown. Unless it's just me. I want a really weird brown. Called, we call it mousy brown. And this is kind of what this is, but with the grey highlights. I'll come into more detail about the highlights in a little bit. But yeah, so I was just there like, oh my gosh, it's like I've gone back to younger me with natural hair. That's what it looks like from far away. Like this would be my hair if I never dyed it, never cut it, maybe. I'd like to think it'd get this long, but yeah, <laughs> I just found it really funny. But I really like it, which is weird because I did not like my, my natural hair colour at all. Uh, that's why I dyed it. But I really like it. Anyway, back onto the review. <sighs> so, as I said, with this offer it was free shipping, so I can't tell, like, I don't know how much it usually is on shipping. The wig itself cost $40.50 which is about like it's like 20 something pounds isn't it? I'm really bad at converting. I've converted the I've converted the total cost though um because I want to be accurate because I got 10% off uh it came to $37 is it cent? 26 cent? so $37 26 cent which comes to 24 pounds 79. 25 quid, basically, is a really good price for a wig, especially a really long wig. Like, look how long it is. Look, I will put a picture, like, I have, I have some pictures of how long this wig is. Like, it is so long. It's amazing. <laughs> but yeah, the shop is based in Sweden, so that's quite close to where I am. Kinda. I'm in England, if you didn't know. And it took, there's a little hair here that I haven't cut. <laughs> eh. It took like a week and about five days, like just under two weeks to get to me. So that was really quick. I was really happy with how quick it was. And when it arrived, it came in a really well sealed cardboard box. And then in that it came with this really nice oh wrong way <laughs> really nice um wallet plastic wallet like i always keep my plastic wallets anyway but look how pretty it is 
Like it says Dreamholic on and really pretty design. Yeah, it's slightly um it's like uh you know, it's not clear, foggy, you know, on one side and then it's clear on the other side. But it's really nice. Obviously it's resealable and it's star. But yeah, so it's it's super pretty. So I, I obviously I keep my wig in that. It's all good. <laughs> So when I got this, it came with a really long fringe, about like this long. Again, I have a picture. <laughs> and yeah, so you can style it however you want. I have actually bought a vague cosplay for this, so I've styled it. Um, I don't know if anyone can guess the cosplay. And to any of my Facebook friends watching this, don't say, because I've announced it on my personal Facebook, but I kind of want to see if someone can guess before I get it done. I've only got the wig and the skirt at the moment. Hint, she wears a skirt! Oh wow, who could it be? Um, but yeah, so I was really happy that I could get someone to cosplay this for. Cosplay this for? Cosplay this with. I'm, I can't talk. It is a um, Japanese high temperature, you know, styled wig, so you can like curl it and like I might straighten these bits at some point, make them all like this, because they curl in. They curled in a bit more when I first got it, but I've worn it a few times, so with me doing that it's kind of come out anyway. But yeah, so you can heat style them, but obviously don't keep styling them too much, okay? You be gentle with them. It's still a wig, okay? Yes. <laughs> but yeah, also, um, it is adjustable. Like, I think I put mine on a little bit too tight today. Um, each wig is, like, slightly different with the adjustments. Um, so some wigs you can put them on tighter and they're fine. And this one, um, I think I put this one on a bit too tight. Um, but it's okay. Also, what's nice about it, it has the little um, Dreamholic label in the netting. It also has the nice flowery netting, which always just, I like it. It's pretty. But what's also really nice about this wig is it has clips on the front here and the sides. It's more of like a, this more like slides on here and then they're like uh, more like proper clips. If you've had a clip in extensions, they're like the clips for the clip in extensions. So you don't have to bother with silly little slides, you know, making sure it stays in. It's got proper clips to do so, which I think is really good. I've not had a wig that's done that before. And yeah, I didn't even realise at first I was so stupid. I was just happy that I like you know, when I first, <laughs> I was like, oh, it's pretty, not what I expected, but it's pretty, and I was trying it on, and yeah, I took it off, and then I was like, oh, there's, there's clips, like, what? Yeah, it's really, really cool. So I'll talk about the colour, as obviously, that was a bit of a mess up for me, but I still, I still, still got what I technically wanted. The colour is like a, like I said, mousy brown with grey highlights, like does individual grey hairs, they're not like, it's quite of a dull grey, so it, like I said it's not really obvious like that there's grey, <laughs> like I'm sure you can, like it doesn't, it doesn't look obvious that there's grey at all, like from far away. But yeah, the material, like I said, it's you know, it's it's high quality, it's the Japanese um, synthetic high, high temperature stuff. It's really, um, it's really soft, like, you probably see me doing this a lot. But I'm also doing this a lot because, like, it doesn't tangle that much, it tangles a bit. Because obviously it's long, it's like, so long. So, it will tangle a little bit. But because it's like, it's thick but it's not... It's not too thick, like, I have another wig of a similar length and that's really thick, like super thick, and that gets really tangled. 
So this is like the good between, like it's not thin. Like you have all this and then I still have some at the back. And it looks like a good head of hair. <laughs> so it doesn't, cause it's so like silky and smooth and there's not too much, like not too many fibers or too many thick fibers going on at once. It doesn't tangle that much. It's only really been tangling this third time. It tangled a little bit the second time. I haven't worn it that much. I haven't been wearing my wigs as much because I've been so busy with college. So I just haven't been bothering with like effort with <laughs> my appearance. So yeah, I do plan on wearing this wig a lot more though when I can because I really like it. <laughs> Especially when I cosplay, I can't wait to cosplay with it. It's going to be great. But yeah, and as well, it's really natural looking where it has like, it's not like roots. It's, um, it is, but it isn't. It's what it, it's what it naturally looks like. When I had this hair color, that's what the top of my head looked like. It looks darker than it is and then it gets lighter. And yeah, it's lovely. <sighs> I just love it. But yeah, you can't see any of the netting. The netting is brown, as you could could have seen with those photos that I posted earlier, showing the clips and that. The netting is brown. So even if for some reason, like, all the hair, for some reason, like, moved to the side, it wouldn't be, like, the most obvious thing in the world because it's brown. It'd probably be more obvious because my blue hair would be <laughs> peeking out, but... I can't think what else to say. I think I've said everything. I haven't done a wig review in a while, I'm sorry. So I'm starting to get a migraine. <laughs> um, so I should really uh, go now. <laughs> but anyway, I hope this helped. I, am, I have got a blog review in the description and that will have all the links and any more detail if I think of anything more. But right now, yeah, my head's really starting to hurt, so. I should go. <sighs> Sorry guys if I've missed anything out. I really wanted to get this review done this weekend, so I'll have it up soon. But yeah, thank you for watching. I hope this helped. If you want to ask any questions, either ask on the YouTube comments or on my blog, either, either or, it's fine with me. But yeah, first of all, do check my blog if I have missed something because I may have put it in there and then if not then comment because yeah my brain's dying right now <laughs> so I probably forgot something but yeah thank you for watching I don't know if I already said that I'm forgetting what I'm saying <laughs> <laughs> but yeah go check out Dreamholic they have a really really pretty collection <laughs> bye